question number 12 2010 number paper 2 uh, part a we are told expand and simplify 2 minus x or into bracket to power 5 you get two marks part b use the first four terms of the expansion in part a above to find the approximate value of 1.5 to power 1.8 power 5 to two decimal places and you get two marks so let's start with part a so this is binomial expansion and you are supposed to apply the use the binomial expansion to get the first of all you get the coefficient uh, representing this index uh, so you can get that from the mathematical tables so or four figure table uh, we have a page for the uh, table of coefficient and the coefficient when when the index is five we have it is one we have five we have ten we have ten again and we have uh, five again and we have one so these are the coefficients so we need to expand this using this coefficient uh, so we have we can say 2 minus x all this is raised to power 5 uh, we say this is uh, 2 to power 5 uh, when we have a minus sign here we we alternate the minus and positive why let me show you so because when you say plus uh, we have the next coefficient is 5 2 reduces by 1 the, the index so it comes to 2 to power 4 and then we have minus x uh, to power 1 as uh, because when you add the index should be uh, should add up to 5 so you see x here is negative so negative and positive here will change to negative so that is why we interchange so now I can, so and to make now the work easier uh, what we do is we say it is minus 5 uh, we have 2 to power 4 and we have x uh, then we have plus the next coefficient is 10 uh, we multiply by 2 to power 3 and we multiply by x squared so we put minus there uh, we say the next coefficient is uh, 10 uh, we have 2 to power 2 to power 2 and we have x cubed then we have plus 5 multiplied by 2 to power 1 and x to power 4 and finally we have minus x to power 5 so that is expansion which we can write 2 to power 5 is 32 uh, minus uh, 2 to power 4 is 16 16 times 5 will give you 80 x uh, so we have plus this is 8 uh, 8 times 10 is 80 so we have 80 x squared uh, we have minus this is 4 2 squared is 4 times 10 you get 40 x cubed and we have plus uh, this is a uh, 10 to power and x to power 4 and finally we have x to power 5 so that is how you expand that so you will be able to get one mark for the answer and one mark for the extension uh, expansion that is so this is a now we look at part b but b we are, we are supposed to use the first four terms uh, to of the expansion to approximate the value of the 1.85 so the first thing is uh, to 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 be able to connect 1.85 how do we relate to 2 minus x so we can say this is equals to 2 minus uh, 0 0.2 and this will be to power 5 so 2 minus 0 0.2 is the same as 1.8 so we have not changed so what this means is that uh, now uh, z minus 0 0.2 uh, 0 0.2 will take the place of x so we just substitute we start with 32 now we have minus 80 now instead of x we write 0 0.2 we have plus 80 uh, we multiply by 0 0.2 uh, squared and then we have a minus 40 uh, multiply by 0 0.2 
0 0.02 to power 3 uh, we have plus uh, we can continue but we are supposed to use the first four terms so that is 1 2 3 and 4 those are the first four terms so what we need now to work out is uh, uh, compute this so we have that 2 minus uh, you multiply 0 0.2 you can put bracket there to separate 0 0.2 times 80 and that will give you 16 there you, you can use your calculator to make it uh, to work it a bit faster so 0 0.2 squared you multiply by 80 using your calculator you'll be able to get that 3.2 and then we have minus uh, 0 0.2 cubed uh, you multiply by 40 uh, you should be able to get 0 0.32 now with that you uh, you compute that you'll be able to get 18.88 so that is uh, and this is uh, we are told to work to two decimal places uh, so this is to two decimal places so that is how you work out that so the mo mo important thing here is uh, you know how to expand using the binomial expansion uh, but you should be able to apply that the coefficient if you don't have mathematical tables then you can generate it using a pascal triangle uh, you remember the one that we said one 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 two uh, one one uh, three this is uh, one this is three this is one like that uh, so you can generate it like that but uh, during the exam of course you must have a mathematical table or four figure table as it is a requirement so that is how you do that. I hope you have followed.